A warm welcome to all of you, John Champion and Jim Beglin on commentary duty today. So let's get down to business. Asuikoto with the crucial intervention. Angwa looking to receive the ball. Break could be on. No, no way through there. Lifts it through. Surely! Another play it goes for throw. Good opportunity for a cross here. Vital interception there. Popov. Makun. He moves in swiftly. Manolev. Manolev. Threatening through ball, out towards the byline, he's found space. Oh, well defended. Matty. A crucial intervention there. Quickly done that. It's never easy keeping the ball under control when the pressure's been applied like that. I think he asked too much of himself. Angwa. It's lovely to look at, and if they just step up the pace a bit, they could carve out that opening. Oh, wonderful. For me, it's one of the best sights on a football pitch, seeing this kind of direct running at defenders. And a cross. Well struck. Oh, listen, I think you can understand at times that the pace of the game pressures players into split-second decisions, and sometimes they just make the wrong one, and I think he would have been better placing that. Bulgaria producing the first shot on goal of the game. The pass needed to be better there, and there is half-time. I think it's been a very impressive defensive effort. They've never been broken down and contained the opposition attack extremely well. It's nil-nil, so nothing to separate them. The whistle goes for the second half. Forward push gains momentum. Oh, fine through ball down the middle. He's onside. Trying to play for throw. A chance to counter attack here. Ball stolen. Pop off. That'll be a throw-in. Can I be it? I think they're building the play really nicely. If they can just find the right through ball, they could be in on goal. Looking to cut inside. Looking for wits. And a header. And it's taken with some style. And the game finally comes to life in the second half. Sweet header, expertly dispatched. Well, as contact goes, that was tremendous, and it helped him to direct it exactly where he wanted into that net. I think when it comes to the area of the top, this fella has definitely no sledge. So we start again at 1-0.
Well, look, provided they don't go into panic mode, there's no reason as to why they can't get right back into this now. It's on for him. Hits it. Oh, good block. He was in the right place. Matty quickly closed down. Asuikoto. It's a threatening through ball. Plays it back to the keeper. Looking to play on the break. Makun. No, that wasn't the best of passes. And he finds a bit of space here. Floats it. Long ball over the top. Strikes it. They were so nearly punished for their mistake. Well, I think you can only praise that sort of alertness and the way he almost knew what was going to happen. He got there really early, that was top stuff for me. Cameroon coming under quite a barrage at the moment. There is the final whistle. By the narrowest of margins, they have come through this test. And that owed a lot to the defence.